what's up guys so quick video uh i'm still learning as i go here but i found a problem and it's just really kind of weird uh on these trains how this works so uh my problem ended up being uh, a failed rtom board which is my option board which the only reason this is in this unit is the smoke detector was connected to it and it was giving me a false signal and nothing would run like it had an actual smoke detector tripped um I wired around it. We're wired into the e-stop now. I pulled my jumper out. Uh, so no big deal there. But as I was checking, I started to lean towards my RTOM board because I've got the blower contactor, the coil, disconnected. And you see my lead there. And if I go to ground, 26 volts. Looks like that contactor should be pulled in. But, it's not. That's because of the triac, I believe it's a triac, that they're using in these boards. So I'm getting the back feed of voltage with that wire disconnected. And it sure looks like when you pull that wire off and check it, the damn contact, contactor should be energized. So just a weird little deal. Know, know what you got. Um, when you're dealing with this stuff because i know guys a lot of guys get tripped up on train units but uh not too bad once you know what you're dealing with and this one tripped me up a, a bit and so just a little test here let's go back to ground 26.4 now let's put it in test and give it a call for that blower I heard it click. That's the call from my blower. And you can see 26.8. So somebody out there, give me a simple way to explain this. And there's my blower. Really weird how that works but it's something to do with the board. There's not an actual relay in the board. It's uh, basically grounding uh, one side of that voltage to complete the circuit and draw in that contactor. So let me know what y'all think. Leave me a comment. Explain this easily for everybody else in the comments. I'll see you guys on the next one.